This is the car Rockledge police say hit and killed 37 year old Christopher Holton Monday. The crash happened on Barnes Boulevard just before 1230 in the morning. Investigators say Holton's bicycle was struck from behind. Now this man who was behind the wheel is being investigated for a hit and run. Detectives say he may have been driving drunk. Witnesses called 911 after they say they saw him driving strangely on US 1. I noticed he was on the wrong side of the road. Um, he, I don't, it was scary. He just kept going. I couldn't believe he didn't realize he was on the wrong side of the road. With a blown out tire, car was smoking. I mean, I tried. We, we tried hard to stop him. But the driver kept going. They say he was taken into custody a short time later and is cooperating. We are not showing his face because he hasn't been charged. Investigators are now working to determine if he will be. They say they still have to interview witnesses, analyze the car, and await the results of the blood alcohol test. Those who spotted the deadly driver say they're sad a life was lost. I, I tried to prevent that. That was the whole reason for calling 911. I was trying to prevent a fatality and now knowing that he actually did kill somebody it, it's sad and it should be a wake-up call for people who drink and drive in Rockledge Alex Villarreal West 2 News detectives tell us the driver is a 25 year old from Brevard County we are not identifying him because he has not been charged